Bank tellers have gone from someone you visit to something you hold in your hand. Cash is now just zeros and ones. Big data is the new brick and mortar. But these improvements are outrunning the pace of financial regulatory reporting. So we asked, can the same technology speeding up finance increase the efficiency of the reporting system behind it? At R2A, the RegTech for Regulators Accelerator, this is our aim. We partner with leading financial authorities to pioneer the next generation of tools and techniques for market supervision and policy analysis to keep pace with change, one solution at a time. Here's how. The Central Bank of the Philippines, Banco Central Ang Pilipinas, or BSP, wanted to speed up the regulatory reporting process, which involved the tedious cycle of validation. As financial inclusion and digital innovation have grown in the Philippines, so have the data compilation challenges for banks and regulators. Previously, banks were tasked with an extensive and time-consuming validation process involving more than 240 reporting templates with 100,000 plus data points. The resulting delays and the scope for human error complicated BSP's data and statistical tasks. We partner with Compliant Risk Technology to prototype a modern API that requires minimal manual intervention to directly connect the databases of commercial banks with the Philippine Central Bank. A new processing engine quickly sorts and validates incoming data, cleaning it and sending it to a secure centralized database. Customized filters allow for easy interpretation of the data by regulators. This unified and automated reporting format replaced the numerous manually prepared Excel-based templates. The same 7,000 data validation rules are still being applied, and processing time for bank submissions was cut from more than 30 minutes, not including manual validation, to just 10 seconds each. The API prototype took previously cumbersome processes and provided tremendous efficiency gains while earning the regulatory burden for both reporting institutions and BSP. Adoption of this approach, combined with greater use of machine learning, promises to yield even more benefits, including improved supervision and policy responsiveness, better tailoring of monetary policy to the economy, and greater access to financial services for millions of citizens.